When I was uh, trying to become an internist, um, which is kind of what we do before we do cancer, um, I did a lot of rotations in the hospital. And my first rotation was for cancer patients. At the end of it, I just really enjoyed it. I just like the patient interactions and really feeling like I made a difference. And I like talking to families, I like talking to patients. So that's what I ended up doing. <laughs> There's a lot of new interesting ways of treating cancers. And it's just awesome because for, for now, I'm able to give you some sort of treatments that I don't, I couldn't, wouldn't be able to give someone else like before. It's been really awesome to be able to be able to make a difference for more people. I've had family members who've had diagnoses like this, and I remember the biggest issue was that they didn't know what to expect. The, the ability to tell folks, hey, this is what's coming, here's what we're gonna do, I'm gonna be your quarterback, I'm gonna get the team together, we're gonna fix this, and we're gonna figure it out for you, that's awesome. Like, there's nothing better than that, I think. Our team is awesome because I feel that we have really good communication. Cancer is no longer an individual sport. Cancer care is more of a team sport at this point and you want your team to talk to each other. At least that's what I tell my patients. I think that there are a lot of situations where people just go into the office, see their doctor for five minutes, and then the doctor just runs out of the door. And to me, that's really frustrating because I've been on that situation where a doctor has done that to me. Things that help me remember patients are like, hey, what are they interested in? Where are they going? What, what are they doing with their lives? What's their family up to? And I feel like if you don't know what's going on with their family, you, you don't really know them. I do want to remember and, and be able to say, yeah, I remember that patient and I remember what's going on and I remember why they feel the way they feel and I remember how stressed out they were before. And it's really interesting because I really like the idea of like, they were stressed out when they first came to see me and then years down the line, they're like, hey, I'm doing great. And that's a huge difference like, to me at least. I see it, so that's, that's the best part. I love taking care of people. I think that that is really, the reason I got into this business. If I can help answer some of those questions and give you that peace of mind and put out a plan for you so you know what's coming and you know what to do and you know how to get there, that's, that's why I do what I do.